Welcome back to GarageBand Basics. Today, part 7, we're looking at the second half of the movie track. Yesterday we talked about putting in a movie track, um, dragging in an mp4 into the movie track, um, taking away the movie sound, and then creating our new narration and our new music. Here you'll see the project completed. We've got the narration in, we've got the music put into the background, and um, it's, it's all ready to export at this point. Um, I've got all of my volume changes made. Everything is ready to go. I won't be able to change anything after I export unless I come back to the original project. So, um, to export your narration, or your soundtrack if you will, um, you go up to share, you're going to export the movie to disk. Once you export the movie, for our purposes, I'd like you to take it and make it um, an iPod size, okay, which is going to shrink it down a little bit, but it's still keep the audio quality where we want it. And I'm going to go ahead and click export. Now, choose where I want to save this to. I'm going to put this onto the desktop so it'll be easy to drag onto the server. So I go ahead and click Save. Make sure when you name your files that you also name them um, not only with narration or soundtrack, but with your name as well. So now it is mixed down, normalized, and converted my clip here. And it goes pretty quick because the movie has already been processed for the most part. It's just adding the sound onto it. And I chose the iPod setting, so it's actually going to compress everything here. We're going to fast forward a little bit because we don't need to see all of this. Okay, now that my movie is completed here and it's done compressing, um, I've actually got two files that are on my desktop. This is the GarageBand file. I can usually tell that because the icon has got, it shows the workspace. And then the M4V is the new one here. Um, M4V is a movie file. Um, it's a smaller size. It's designed for iPods, iPads, iPhones, any mobile device. I'm going to take that one and, of course, I'm going to uh, drag that into um, the server. Um, that completes GarageBand Basics Part 7, and that should wrap up our movie track for today. These are due by the end of the hour, um, and uh, good luck, and have a great weekend.